my beautiful crispy rolls. Now they're just out of the oven at the moment. They'll take a couple of minutes just to cool down. They've been in there for 10 minutes, around 200, and they brings back a beautiful color, the smell, as if you'd bake the rolls in your own kitchen. Now, I'm gonna make a sandwich. Basically, it's gonna be a posh fish finger-ish sandwich. Now, bit of cod. All I'm gonna do is coat it in some flour, like so. You can use fish fingers if you wish, and if you don't want to use fish and you want to use a burger, you can if you want. I just think this is particularly beautiful. So I've got a nice bit of cod. I've got some hot oil here, straight in. I've fried off a bit of cod. Now I've got my rolls here. Beautiful brown color. Now, it feels beautifully soft. And again, it feels like you've just made it in your own oven. It, the smell in here of bread mixed with the fish is gorgeous. Now to start with, I'm gonna put a little bit of rocket on this sandwich. Load it up. Nice big slice of tomato. Get a little bit of fish. You can use fish fingers if you wish. Place that onto the top. And obviously, tartar sauce or mayonnaise is entirely up to you. Good dollop. I love tartar sauce. Sitting on the top. And there you have a beautiful sandwich. A posh fish finger sandwich, utilising the roll. See, there's nothing better than bread and butter and a load of fish and chips. I mean, who doesn't like fish and chips, regardless of the time of year? That, for me, is a perfect little treat. A posh fish finger sandwich with a load of chips, and you've even got some tomato sauce too.